Good morning! Today, we're going to explore a true gem in the world of architecture, the Ban Tita House, designed and built by the incredibly talented folks at Yang Naro Studio. Now, let me tell you, these guys are the real deal when it comes to creating buildings that are not only beautiful, but also deeply connected to the local culture and environment of Northern Thailand. They've got a team of skilled artisans and architects who really know their stuff, and they draw inspiration from indigenous and vernacular styles to create something truly unique. But what really sets Yangnar Studio apart is their focus on the human aspect of building. They don't just design and construct houses, they collaborate with local builders, incorporate traditional craftsmen skills, and constantly refine their process to create spaces that truly reflect the people who will live in them. It's like they're redefining what it means to be an architect, putting the user at the center of everything they do. Now, let's take a closer look at the Bantita house itself. This place is spread out over three levels, and the way they've designed it is just genius. At the bottom, you've got your reception area, where you can welcome guests and make them feel at home. Then, as you move up, you come to this amazing connecting balcony called the Chan. It's like the heart of the house, linking everything together and offering a space where you can just hang out and enjoy the view. As you step into this house, the first thing you notice is the floor beneath your feet. It's made of wood, but not just any ordinary wood. This floor is designed to let the sunlight and rainwater pass right through it creating an incredible experience that blends the indoors with the outdoors. Can you imagine how amazing it would be to feel the warmth of the sun on your skin as you walk through your living room? Or to hear the gentle pattern of raindrops hitting the floor, knowing that you're still sheltered from the elements? It's like bringing a piece of nature into your home. And it's just one of the many ways that Young Nar Studio has used authentic craftsmanship techniques to create something truly remarkable. The attention to detail in this house is astounding. Every element from the walls to the ceiling has been carefully considered and crafted with the utmost care. It's clear that the designers at Young Nar Studio have a deep appreciation for the beauty and simplicity of natural materials and they've used them to create a space that feels both modern and timeless. As you explore the house further, you can't help but marvel at the way the light filters through the floor, casting intricate patterns on the walls and furniture. It's a constant reminder of the world outside, and it helps to create a sense of connection between the interior and exterior spaces. But the floor isn't just a visual feature, it's also a functional one. The gaps between the wooden planks allow for natural ventilation, keeping the house cool and comfortable even on the hottest days. Young Nerd Studio have taken a traditional material like wood and transformed it into a something completely new and exciting. And in doing so, they've created a home that feels alive, vibrant, and deeply connected to the natural world around it. As you keep moving up, you come to the top level where you'll find the bedroom and working area. The way they have gradually increased the elevation from the ground to this private space is so skillfully done, and it really enhances the overall experience of living in the Ban Tita house. Now, I've got to talk about the way they have designed the walls. Instead of just putting some boring flat surfaces, they've created this incredible sliding wall system called Fa Lai. It's got this rhythmic flow that captures the wind and provides natural ventilation, and you can even add screen paneling to keep those pesky mosquitoes out. 
It's like what walls are alive, pushing in and out to create a space that feels dynamic and responsive to the environment. And take a moment to appreciate the way they've used repurposed old wood and shingle roofs in the living room. It adds so much character and warmth to the space, and it's a testament to Young Nor's studio commitment to sustainability and respect for the past. But perhaps what's being impressive about the Ban Tita house is the way every single detail has been considered, from the direction of the sun and wind to the way the house will be maintained and used over time. It's clear that Young Nor's studio has put an incredible amount of thought and care into every aspect of this design. And the result is a home that doesn't just look amazing but functions beautifully too. In the end, what Young Nurse Studio has created with the Bantita House is more than just a building. It's a reflection of the wisdom and artistry of the local culture. And a testament to the power of architecture to shape the way we live. It's a home that seamlessly blends into the lives of its inhabitants. And I can only imagine how incredible it must be to wake up every day in a space like this. I hope this video has given you a little glimpse into the magic of this incredible place and maybe even inspired you to think differently about the spaces you live in. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to our channel for more amazing architecture content. Until next time, take care and stay curious.